Hopefully I get this on the first try, but I'm not sure I will. So this is gonna be a primer video to sign up for Pearson and register for Mrs. Rhodes' class. So um, here's the deal. If you go into Canvas and you open up your Math 3A or Math 103 course, you should see a line here that says how to get a book and access in Pearson My Math Lab. And you'd select that. So for the Math 103 or Math 3A class, your code is going to be Rhodes 61377. I'm going to go back to the 103 class and you'll find this in the same spot, right? How to get book a book and access to Pearson My Math Lab, right there. And here, the instructor's code ID is in bold, it's right there, Rhodes 90351. So, what you would do next, easiest way to find Pearson, is to go right here and say, Pearson, login, right there. And you're gonna to wanna to select Pearson, My Lab and Mastering. And that'll take you to this page. So then you're going to go to register where it says student. You're going to select that. Now it tells you you need these three things. You need an email address, the instructor's course ID, and an access code, credit card, or PayPal. So you definitely need the first two, but the third one you're not going to need immediately. You have 14 days once you start this course to be able to pay for access to the course. So I'm going to click OK Register now. All right, so here's where we enter the course code. Now I am going to enter in the first one that I copied there, and I'm going to continue to register. So here is where I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and pick this middle option, right, right, right here, where it says to create an account, and hit create. And I'm gonna put in an email. I'm gonna use uh, Rene Descartes. Three one four one five nine at gmail dot com, and I'm gonna make. I'm just gonna go ahead and make my username the same as my email because it'll be easier to, to to remember that way. But you could make this anything that you can remember, and then I'm gonna create a password, and I'm not gonna tell you what that is, but. And then I re-enter that password. My first name is Renee. My last name is Descartes. And for my security question, we're gonna say, what town was I born in? Well, Renee Descartes was born in the city of Descartes. Actually, it was cart, but we're gonna go ahead and use the last name. You agree to the terms. You have to agree to this next little thing here. And you go ahead and click create account. Now you're gonna get this page, all right? Register, use a credit card, use an access code, all these different things. Now, I do not recommend this option here because this isn't a 24 month class. It's an 18 week class. It'll be over in 18 weeks. So if you're gonna pay for it immediately, I'd really recommend this option here for $74.99. But in the meantime, if you don't wanna do that, if you look down here at the bottom, there's a get temporary access without payment for 14 days. And click that. And it says, are you sure that you want temporary access to this course? Well, if you want to do your work, then yeah. And now it'll open up, be patient, and we get this screen. Then we go, go to my courses. And it'll open. It gives you the little warning about temporary access. And it, you know, basically notifies you the whole way along that you have to pay. But... It'll give you access to the course so that you can start doing homework, tests, all that stuff, okay? So that's my little video on how to get started, and I hope it helps you. So 
have a great day. Thanks for watching.